Time to move on to the first area of high water pass. The thing I don't get is the boss the boss escaped from the game. So why are you trying to fight him in the game? Because I suppose he's invulnerable in the real world, maybe? I don't know. Or, or you just suck that much in the real world. <laughs> he thinks he's the cool kid, but he's actually just another po sad little nerd. It ain't easy. Oh, wait. Oh. Uh, oh, damn it. I could jump high enough to activate the secret P-block, but not jump high enough to actually reach it. Night mode! Right then, so how do we get up there? Uh, there we go, that's the right angle. So we're not getting up there in a hurry. This is another interesting thing, by the way. Jumping diagonally allows you to jump higher than just jumping straight up. That makes precious little sense. <laughs> C, there we go. I forgot that you don't that uh, you are not supposed to hold C. You're supposed to hammer C in order to. Uh, Get over those dance spikes. That is nice, though. I mean, so few games let you climb walls. It's uh, yeah. it's usually their way of keeping you in. Yeah. Now the funny thing is that uh, there are several old first-person RPGs and stuff that allow you to climb things. One of one that I enjoy in particular is the Bethesda's Dragonfall. Oh no, sorry, Daggerfall, what am I saying? God, I'm, uh, I'm a bit confused today, sorry everyone. Yes, Daggerfall, of course. Where you actually have climbing as a skill that allows you to scale pretty much any wall in the game. Which leads to a lot of hilarity when you decide to climb up things that you aren't really supposed to climb up. <laughs> um, it's certainly very difficult to keep the player in where you want to keep them in. Uh, when there's, there's, uh, basically free movement up walls. I mean, yeah. other than water, there's not many other barriers that, uh, you can put in. And today, when every game that doesn't have swimming is universally panned, you can't really use that either. Ultima 9, swimming's still difficult. Um, I don't know if that's, well, yeah, most games do, uh, have swimming. Yeah, the, um, it's hard to keep players in. <laughs> yeah. Well, then again, the question is, in most games, why would you? Well, it could just be hard. Uh, most, most, uh, what can I say, strife, most problems are at least somewhat created by the fact that you can't get to where you're going easily, or you can't you know, uh, access a, a thing that you need to get to. It should be like, it so should be like Fantasy Star. I think it should be like Fantasy Star, where you can reach what you think <laughs> is the final boss without the ability to actually fight him. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, then, then it becomes huge dick moves. samurai all the way through this place, yo. Get away from me, Crystal. I don't believe in that new age nonsense. <laughs> there we go. There are a lot of enemies here. They do not seem terribly fond of me either. 
Whoa, I was not expecting that hand to jump out like that. The game keeps you on your toes. Ah, there we go. Oh, um... This was a pretty different place. There we go. Let's see if we can get all the bonuses. Uh... Oh, yes. Right, so let's see if we can actually get back out as well. Having a giant gun to kill things with is a lot cooler if there are things to kill. Oh right, I forgot. I actually have to stand, damn me. There we go, let's uh, head on up. And that takes care of that. Now I have no idea where the hell we are. Okay. Those guys were not happy to see me. Oh, now this guy I re recognize. Man, it must be nice to have all the licenses so I can reference your own games. Get up on there. Thank you. Ah. I like how he kid gives me a look every time he faces a jump, like yeah. Great work, asshole. <laughs> it's your fault. How about you actually jump properly? God damn. I'm never getting up there, am I? <laughs> <laughs> oh well. That was Kid Chameleon, everyone. <laughs> Let's see here now. The two rats want me to do haunting. Quickie. I have never heard of this game. <laughs> 